The Fox 13 News investigative team has been telling you about Provo-based Vivint Smart Home reaching settlements for deceptive sales practices. Fox 13 News investigative reporter Nate Carlisle has details on how Vivint customers in a neighboring state can recover money. The Arizona Attorney General has entered into an agreement with Vivint Smart Home to resolve what the AG called false representations to induce customers to sign a contract. System disarmed. Vivint has agreed to pay $325,000 in penalties and legal fees. The company will pay another $75,000 in restitution to customers. We talked to one Vivint customer in Kingman, Arizona, who complained to the state's attorney general. Vivint came by and said they can do it for about $44.95 a month, around that ballpark. So I said, okay, yeah. So uh, after I signed up, it jumped up to almost $80 a month. The service is good. It's just the uh, overpricing and the deception of the product. How much money do you hope you're entitled to recover? Maybe a couple thousand dollars, I, I believe, would be fair. Any Vivint Smart Home customer in Arizona who believes they are entitled to restitution should file a complaint with the state's Consumer Complaints Division at the web address on the screen. You can also find a link on our website, fox13now.com. The deadline to file is June 30th. A Vivint spokesman issued a statement saying, we are pleased to have resolved the matter with the Arizona Attorney General's office and are grateful to move forward from an investigation that began more than seven years ago. We are committed to operating with integrity and delivering exceptional service to Vivint Smart Home customers in Arizona. Arming away. Exit now. In the newsroom, Nate Carlisle, Fox 13 News, Utah.